this. Item five, unfinished business. In Nevada County Sheriff's Department Special Committee to address, discuss, and take action for request of RSQ. Dean called me a while ago and asked me to request that you all postpone this for one week. He's still waiting for a call back from Ed. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He just asked that it be postponed for a week. Farm Bureau, we, we've got the proclamation there, and um, we'll have some activities, and they'll be out at the um, Spring Livestock Show out there for memberships, and uh, we'll have some goodies at the office all that week. And I'm not sure whether the ladies will be bringing it up at the courthouse, or they'll just have it at the office. Uh, the final details haven't been ironed out yet. So when is Farm Bureau week? This way, that's what yeah. I thought. Oh, ladies usually bring stuff. <laughs> yeah, no, it's the it's the same week as the fair, oh. fair week, which is oh, February. Usually the last week of February. It's the last weekend. The proclamation doesn't say. Yeah, it says under there. I didn't even bring it with me. Um, yeah, the calendar's not changed over to February. It should be like starts President's starts President's Day that Monday. Oh, it goes through right. the week. Yep, 17th through the 21st. Yeah. It's Farm Bureau Week. Farm Bureau Week. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You said 17th through the 21st? Yes. yes. Oh. Well, they usually bring goodies to the courthouse. You tell them to get on the bus. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'll read this off as a proclamation. Whereas, Noata County Farm Bureau as a nonprofit general farm organization operating within the boundaries of Noata County, the state of Oklahoma has served farmers and ranchers of this great county since 1942 and whereas the Noata County Farm Bureau through its concern or both producers and consumers helps them develop a basic understanding of the complex structure that puts food on the table of all Americans and most of the world and whereas the Noata County Farm Bureau has dedicated itself and its members to maintaining agriculture as an honorable and respected profession which has been the basis for much of the economic prosperity in Noata County and the state of Oklahoma. And whereas more than 550 member families in Noata County are members of the Noata County Farm Bureau. Now therefore, uh, myself, Chairman of the Noata County Commission, do hereby proclaim this week of February 17th through the 21st, 2020 as Farm Bureau Week. Appreciate it. Farm Bureau does a lot, and I mean, I know my daughter received a scholarship from Farm Bureau. Yes, um, the kids that are showing at the fair, um, any child that's parents are Farm Bureau members, they will receive anywhere from twenty to twenty-five dollars of add-on money.
Thank you. Uh, item C, Berkeley to address concerns of the plumbing issues in the courthouse. Gentlemen, we've got some plumbing. I know that deal is old. We've got <coughs> continuing issues that I know we're supposed to have a city inspector to kind of check the plumbing issues and how things go. But a week ago, Friday, well, Thursday afternoon, I was called. Anyway, with the sink back in the kitchen area. I took pictures of it. The, the gentleman, I'm not trying to say he's not doing a good job or but I'm just trying to find the one. Yeah. There's a plumbing from underneath this sink. It's got so many collars in it. You can't tell me that you can't do a little better job than that. I mean that's we're talking about a commercial situation in my opinion when we have stainless steel sinks that ought to have one piece of pipe instead of many junctions. But this is the main issue I have. My camera's sitting there level. That water drains out of that sink and runs around there. That was over one inch of drop. Water don't run uphill. Yeah, it's very clean. Yes. And here is the traps I put under it. When you've got that drain coming off those sinks, and it comes down to that trap, and here this one is already a half inch higher than that. And that puts our water level up here. Yes. Yeah. But whenever the sinks, when they were spilling the other one, it was back draining into this, and it would stand in water. And eventually it settled down. When they put this in, I had an issue with that. Mm -hmm. Just, I, I was going to go in there and redo that, but we didn't get to it. But those lines are just laid in there and not fastened. I didn't think it was going to be at all. No. I actually complained to the sheriff about it that we paid for such work. But mm -hmm. I know it's sound, but it's not neat, you know? You know? And I can say this, when I was down there working on this, I had two inmates help me carry the sink outside so I could fix the legs on it. And I mean, that's how bad the legs were. Yeah, I, I took them off. Yeah. I mean, they looked at them when they just didn't get to it. Yeah. You know? But, it was, but I guess what I'm getting at is I just feel like the plumbing down there, I'm just not real satisfied with what's been done. And I guess if we're going to start paying off on some of these invoices, then I feel like if we can't get a city inspector to come up here and make sure it's done proper, then we need to make ourselves available for anything's done. Then we go down and look at it. Part of the time, your plumber is the city inspector, Mr. Mack. Is the city's plumbing inspector? Is that who it is? There's your problem. I don't have <laughs> No, no, that's not who that is. That's not good. That yeah. They've got somebody else working there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But, uh, Barry. I know at the same time, whenever I went in and took care of this, I guess they did come up. They had two sinks. Was, they had a sink in the front draining room, and then they had a uh, I mean a washing machine that was having issues. I know he come up and cleaned those out. I know that's stuff that you can't see. Anything under that concrete, you're just it's a wild guess. Mm -hmm. It was part of the problem before we chose to let the concrete. To Put a trap in and it had been done without a trap so whoever did that job failed miserably on doing Put the right trap yes and it was poured concrete around it so so we dug through we chiseled through a foot of concrete foot deep and 
I put it half wide to get that back in there. Right? Yeah. Would have been a lot easier to do it the right first time. It's just what we're supposed to do. But I know from some things kind of slipped through the cracks, and this is something that's visible. But I couldn't believe it whenever you have an inmate sitting there with me, and he said, he said, I told him, he said, I watched him lower that drain, and he said, I question, he said, water can't drain uphill. So when you have an inmate even sitting there noticing it. Yeah. Well, in that case, it's going to make it in there, but the problem is it's not going to take any debris, trash, or it's going to plug up real quick because we have standing water in there. Right. So you have no, no. It's got to flow. Carry, it should be a half bubble off. To carry, to carry debris. But anyway, but I moved that line up, and then you can stay in that one. I, I put new legs on it, yeah. and I raised that sink to where everything yeah. flows down. Yeah. But I'm just saying that I'm just kind of disappointed in the service we've had. I would agree on that. But we just when you go and look, it's, it's, it's where do we start? It's the whole, you know. Yeah. But it just seems like it's reoccurring on some of this stuff. Yeah. And I know sometimes you get a situation where you got to kind of just do something temporary to get by until you get the right parts or something. But I like this was kind of a boss job. I was not happy when I walked in there and seen that. Cause, yeah. anyway, I just wanted to voice my concern and try to make sure we kind of start. We're going to pay off and sign off on something. Maybe we need to go try and inspect it if we can get to it. Yeah. That's all I had on him. Didn't mean to ram or anything. It was kind of frustrating. Item D, Discover Recovery Plan District 2. Disaster Recovery Plan District 2, I'm sorry. District 2 and District 2. Okay, yeah. Item E is the same for District 3.